afternoon everybody this is Karen Marge from Hilton Head Island South Carolina oh my gosh okay hold on Woo! where is that bird oh my gosh the problem with the zoom camera sometimes is once your subject moves it's difficult to find it look at oh my gosh okay I know I'm I'm blurring everybody's eyes you're like hold still with the camera but the bird keeps moving okay I do see him oh uh, Oh my gosh. Okay, now I can't. <laughs> hey, you saw the bird for a minute in the grass. Oh my gosh. Well, this is where I am. I'm in Sea Pines Plantation. And I will show you the box. Okay, this is E2. And, boy, it is bright out here right now. And I've got to open this up and see if we've got a nest or eggs. So... Might as well do it at the same time with the audience. Okay, so this is E2. I checked 12 bluebird. Oh my gosh. Well, this is just everything you could ever want. Live action uh, at its best. Okay, let's see if we have... Oh, be careful, be careful. Okay, I have to look. Let me see what we have here. All right, a little bit of vegetation. Now, here's what's completely odd. This does not look like a normal bluebird uh, nest because... See the lichen, that normally indicates um, either part of a tufted titmouse or I'm trying to think of the other bird. Oh, the, well, the chickadee has a lot of lichen. So, well, I didn't get to see what type of bird flew out just now, so it'll be highly interesting uh, when I get home to analyze these photos. But you folks saw it, you saw the bluebirds in the area. Um, most of the time, a bluebird nest will consist of strictly pine needles and that is it but you never know and it's very exciting all right we're signing off with a nice lagoon in the background and some trees and hope you guys have a great day it's karen warge from hilton head island have a great day